Hi, thank you for calling Hilson Leeds City. Hi, I'd like to reserve a room, please. Sure, I'll be more than happy to reserve your room. And let me just ask some questions so I can better assist you. Yes, no so problem. When are you planning to check in? Is this for tonight? N yeah, no, it's for uh, the year 2027. Um, did you say 2027, sir? No, I said tomorrow. Also for tomorrow. So let yes. me just check the availability for you. 2027. And is this only if, is this only for a one night stay? Uh, it's for two nights, please, pal. So it'll be uh, Monday the 27th until Wednesday the 29th, please. 2027. Okay, so thank, thank you very much for that one. So not, hey, listen question. to me. Not a problem, mate. You mm -hmm. are most welcome. Bless you. Oh, bless you. Mwah. Bless you. Yeah, thank you for that. So again, this is from September 27 to 29 of 2021. Is that correct? Yes. Plus six years, yeah. Um, did you say for six years? No, <laughs> no, I'm not going to stay at the Hilton for six years. I said um, plus six years, yeah. So 2021 plus six years, it'll be my white friend. I'm really, sorry, I'm really sorry, sir, but I'm having a hard time. Yes, yes, no, 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 sorry, sorry, it's okay, it's okay, it's my fault. We're getting wires crossed. I was reading something about 2027, and I, and I was thinking that while I was speaking. What I want is a room from Monday the 27th, 2021, until Wednesday the, tw the 29th, 2021, October. Okay. Uh, se uh, Thank you very much. Uh, September, sorry, thanks. Yeah, September. Thank you very much. And I also know how many adults and kids will be staying. Um, just one, please. Okay, thank you for that. So one moment and let me check the availability and the rates for you. Thanks. And what brings you to this hotel, sir, if you don't mind me asking? Is this for leisure or for work? Uh, it's a bit of both, basically. Um, I, I, I want to shit in my hands and um write words on the wall with poo um so it's like um so it's like leisure slash slash business obviously i'd enjoy doing that but it's also part of my job if that's okay okay thank you very much for that information no sir. problem i already have here all of the available hotels that we have so can you also please tell me do you prefer a one bed or a two beds inside uh do you be do you be like a double bed or a single bed, is that what you're trying to say? Yeah, thank you. Yeah, so, yeah, I'll, 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 have, I'll have a bigger bed if that's okay, mate, because obviously from that point I could probably bounce on the bed and then shit in my hands and then put the, um, you know, be able to move the poo that's come out of my bum hole just around the walls and stuff, because I'm going to poo on the walls, you see, is what's going to happen. Thanks. No worries about that, sir. So let me go ahead and check the rates for you. Not a problem. And just for this Steve. one, can you also please tell me, before I got the rates, are you also a member of Hilton Honors so I can get you the best discounted rates that we have? Uh, no, Colette. I'm not, I'm not a member of Hilton Honors, Janet, no. Okay. okay, that's totally fine. So no worries about that one. So Cheers, Karen. Standard rate. Uh, for the double room or a double bed inside the room, still we still have the talking? double Hilton guest room for a partial city or a room for this one. Yes. And the rate is one hundred. Uh, the rate is one hundred sixty-nine pounds per la, 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 la. Yes. Yeah. That's absolutely swimming. Okay. So let me go ahead and Yeah. Thanks. And let me just ask some information from you as well, so we can <sighs> help soon. So may I have your first name and your last name? Yeah, of course, mate. My first name is Poo. My last name is The Bed. So it's uh, P-O-O. Uh, and then my last name is T for Tango. H for Herbivore. E for Echo. Uh, B for Brad. Uh, e for Echo. And D for Pineapple. Thank you very much for that one. May I also have your phone number, please? Not a problem. So my phone number is 
much for that. And may also have your email address. Not a problem. So it's um, M R. So Mister Poo the Bed. M R P O O T H E B E D at hotmail dot com. Thank you very much for that information. And lastly, I'm just going to need your postal code and your address, please. Yes, no problem. My postal code is LS one. 4JJ, so L for pineapple, S for orange, 1 for free, 4 for 7, J for James, and another J for Espialidocious. And the address will be 154 West Point, Leeds. Thanks. Okay, thank you. And I'm really sorry, but can you please repeat your postal code to me? I'm really sorry for this. L S one four J J. So L for Lima, S for scissors, one for one, four for four, and J J for K S I or the Jitter Banana B T. Please. Thank you. No problem. Thank you very much for repeating it to me. And may also know your C P M town or C P R town. My 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 C P R town. Oh oh, city or town? Sorry, pal. I think there was a bit of a connection issue. I think you've got a few stones in your mouth. Um, my my city is Leeds. It's L E E D S. So that's L E D S. Leeds. D C C. Yes, sir. I already have that, sir. And thank you for that. So God bless. I'm just going to need your credit your credit card number just to hold the room for you. And you're you're only going to get charged if the time when you check in. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. What, is it possible that I could get through to the hotel first, just so that I can just ask them a special request? Um, can you please repeat your question to me? Is it okay if you can put me through to reception first, so that I can ask them a special request? Well, for a special request, I can also do it for you as well. Since oh, okay. Okay, okay. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. So, may I also know the request that you want? Yeah, so, so, so basically, my good man, I have, um, mm -hmm. I have a box and it has a big package inside the box. So, I'm, I'm, so it's not really a box, it's more like my boxes. And I'm, I'm trying to bring a big package inside the box. Um, sorry, a, a big package inside of the hotel. Um, I wanted I wanted to know if my big package will fit inside uh, the hotel. It's my it's my sausage and meatballs, you see, just like food, like sausage and meatballs. My big package, my big sausage and meatballs, please. Sure. So if you're if you're just asking me if you can get a big package to your hotel room, and you're asking if yes, but it but it's very hotel. it's like a meaty sausage and meatballs, you see. So let me just check and let me just double check it for you right now if it will be allowed on the property. Yeah, nice one, bro. If you could just say to them, obviously, he's got a big sausage and meatballs in his package. No worries about that one. So Cheers, please, Hamza. One thank you. Right now. Cheers. And I'm checking it again. God bless. Hello? Yes, so thank you for patiently waiting. So about oh, no, pal. Oh, no. Oh, fuck it. Yeah, I think I just follow through. Yes, so Sorry, I've just turtled my ass. Yeah, that's totally fine, sir. So the property also allows allows it to have a box inside the room, but don't forget that it should be organized and there is no water or substances flowing from the box as well, so that they can allow it. They they will allow a bus inside the room. Who said anything yeah, about a bus, but, pal? Yes, yeah, just make sure that it is organized as well. And there is no water or such. No, it's a, yeah, no, no, it's fine. It's it's in my boxes, pal. It's a big package I've got. Sausage and meatballs, you see. My my sausage, that's all. I just I just didn't want it um wafting around in the hotel, that's all. But it but it's all but it's all good, it's in boxes, you see. Hold on, pal. One second. Oh my god, I was blowing some some wind out my ass. Hello? Yes, I'm still here. All right, so um, oh, I'm living on a prayer. Take my hand, I will make it. I swear, oh, I'm living on a prayer. <laughs> Sorry, mate, I've got a bit of Tourette's. Dickhead. Sorry. Oh, fuck. <laughs> 
So would you like me to finalize this reservation for you already? No, of course not. Is there anything else that you would like to know? Yeah. What's the meaning of the what... universe? Is there life on other planets? Does the supernatural really exist? Uh, there's all sorts. Are we ruled by lizard people? Is the government really acting out in our best interests? Are we moving towards a one world order? How is climate change a natural ph phenomenon or is it genuinely human caused? Uh, do dreams mean anything other than just our brain working while we're asleep? There's a lot of questions I have, pal. I could wrap really your mind with my questions. I'm really sorry, sir, but the only questions that I can ask it. That I can answer is about the hotel only. So oh, the oh the Hilton. Okay, the um, right. Okay, I, I, I've got a question for you. I'll, I'll, I'll test you, test your Hilton knowledge. When was the Hilton founded? Uh, are you talking about the year? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, actually, Hilton has many um, hotels in the area. But if you're talking about Hilton only, it is founded on May thirty-one of nineteen nineteen. Wow! Wow! Look at you! You know what? I'll, hey, I'll be honest with you, Hamza. I didn't, I didn't reckon you'd be able to do that. There, you know. I, I reckon I'd say that, and you go, "Ooh, I don't know, I don't know." Fair play, fair play. I rate that. Fair play. Well done. Yeah, hey, round of applause. One second, one second, one second, one second. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's just, let's just get everyone to give you a round of applause, guys. Come out! Come on, everyone! Come on! Wait, hold on, hold on. Come on. One second, one second, wait, wait, round of applause everyone for Hamza, come on, yeah, here we are, woohoo, come on Hamza, good lads, good lads, we're all proud of you, we're all proud of you back home in Mexico City, well done, well done, thanks pal. Take yourself. Anything else that they can help you with? No, that's about it, pal. Thank you. Customer service has been ph phenomenal, though. Phenomenal customer service. Thank you. I'll tell you that. Yeah, thank you, also for that. Mm, so, if there's nothing else, thank you, also. Another wonderful day for you. Okay, sir. Thank you very much. Bye bye. God bless. What a lovely man. I like to say they have phenomenal customer service at the end because then it's sort of like. I feel like it's probably not the case, but I feel like someone's going to go, oh, okay, they've done well, they've done well.